Yo, it's Jabron Lames coming at you with another class edit video, and hands down, this has got to be the best class in the game right now. If you could, could you like this video and subscribe down below for more videos? Um, hopefully I'll be posting once a week from now on, but anyways, this is going to be a setup for the Mauler Mammoth. It's a beast of an LMG, and it'll be hard for honestly any gun to beat at long range, even snipers. First thing you'll notice is that the gun has a super slow rate of fire and a super low recoil. Since it has a super low recoil, uh, when I use it, I use it as a burst fire. This weapon, in my opinion, is the best long range weapon in the game, and it's got to be also one of the easiest guns to use in the game if you play with it right, and uh, if you listen to my tips. It's crazy, but it's a two shot kill anywhere on the body at short to moderately long ranges, but for super long ranges, it'll be a three shot kill. Uh, I've recently unlocked it in Supply Drop, and I've had a huge increase in hate messages for using this gun because, like I said before, you don't have to be good to use this gun. The specific variant of this weapon is why I use it. I haven't used it without a variant yet, so I cannot comment on the default mauler. Um, the Mammoth variant gives you double damage with reduced fire rate, aim down sight speed, and movement speed. It also has Sharpshooter to boost the gun's range. What makes this gun have such low recoil is the VMC sight stacked with foregrip. The VMC sight has an option to hold Y to engage a zoom sight that enables recoil stability and target elimination. I also run the foregrip for even lower recoil. This minimalizes the gun's recoil to almost nothing. The gun barely bounces and is completely controllable. I run quick draw on all my weapons for the faster ADS, but this gun has super slow ADS due to the variant, so this gun definitely needs it. I also run rifled barrel to make sure I'm making the most of my long range engagements and uh, making sure I do the most damage at those ranges. The perks I run are Recon, Dexterity, and Marksman. I run this gun without a silencer, so I don't run Ghost because I'll be on the radar quite a bit anyway. But that isn't a bad thing, because with this class you want the enemies to come to you. So instead of Ghost, I run Recon, and um, Recon just gives me a larger minimap, so when I get my UAVs, when I start streaking, I can just see like where my enemies are if they're close to me because you sure don't want people to get close to you with this gun because it is a very hard gun to use at short range. Dexterity lets me reload faster and helps a lot when running an LMG because of the slow reload. The final perk I run as Marksman is this is to help me not flinch when being shot at because it just makes it harder to kill enemies at longer ranges and especially snipers. This class is probably going to be looked at as a pretty campy setup. Uh, as you will have to play back and watch the long lines of sight. In order to maximize your kills with this weapon, you'll need your enemies to come to you, and um, you want to catch them far away, so I like to use this uh, on any map with a long sight. One map I'd recommend is Terminal. Terminal's check-in room near the security spawn is one of my favorite spots with this gun. As you can see, all the way down to the terminal gates and all the way to the restaurant, and even a little into the bookstore, with lots of range. I use this gun on throwback just because of the long line of sight from the barn to the building near the baseball field. I've been running this class for a few days and it's brought my KD up a ton. The gun is super annoying to your enemies, so as soon as you get 4000 salvage, I would unlock this weapon immediately. Or if you want to try your luck with supply drops, you can get it there too like I did. You might even be lucky enough to get the Mark II variant and get 15% extra experience every kill. But anyways, if you like this video, uh, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching. Peace.